Today's Daily Dose is about kindness. Knowing that kindness is actually your power. You know, I wrote a blog for a friend's site a few months back called Staying in the Flow. And it's funny because I feel as though my entire life has basically been this journey to figuring out how to stay in my own flow, how to stay aligned to my true self. And so obviously a lot of you guys know I make it my life's purpose now to share how I've done that and share how I continue to do that every day. And one of the biggest keys in staying in the flow of your true self and staying in the flow connected to your higher purpose is kindness. You know, when I was really young, it was so heartbreaking to me, heartbreaking to me, <laughs> cheesy, because I used to feel like I was being thrown off or my purpose was being taken away from me or who I truly was was being taken away from me because of the reactions of others, because of the opinions of others, because of life events that I didn't feel were reflecting what I knew my purpose to be. And so then we, we become fearful and we start to push for it and start to do things that are not in alignment with kindness, are not in alignment with our higher self. And what I've learned as I've gotten older is that no one can ever take something from you and life doesn't have to be reflecting to you. The key is it will reflect when you stay in the flow and it's finding how to stay kind and stay loving in those positions where you don't feel supported and you don't feel heard and you don't feel loved. And so today's Daily Dose is about staying in the space of kindness really means that you trust yourself over the opinions of others. You trust your goodness over the evidence that you're seeing. Because when we give into what's already being shown to us, we're kind of giving into the old pattern that is. It takes time to create something. A belief is a repetition of an old thought. And a belief gets reflected to us because the world is our mirror. So if you have old beliefs that you're changing, you have to give it time. And I wish someone would have told me this 20 years ago, but you have to give it time to be reflected. So the most important thing we can do with kindness is being kind to ourself, is trusting that it will be revealed and it will reflect us as long as we stay connected to it and stay true to it. So true self for your health, again, is being true to your inner kindness, being kind to yourself, and being a light of love in the world. So that's your daily dose for today. Have a beautiful day. Namaste.